All right, Mr. Ryan, are you ready to go? I think everything's good. Um, yep, I, I just need to get fuel from the um, fuel tanker. All right, well, everything is good. We got ground crew set already, and um, yeah, I mean, other than that, I think we're good to make our departure for Greater Rockford. It's going to be about a three-hour, no, no, two-and-a-half-hour flight. Everybody is loaded onto the plane right now, so I think we're, I think we're good. We got our ground crew here directing the plane. Uh, Mr. Ryan, don't go too much off the lines, buddy. Yeah. Supposed to be experienced for this thing. Hey, you know, if if ever, uh, worst case scenario, you know, I could take over the controls, you know? If you want to just let me fly ever. Mm. I think that's a good option. I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure about okay, that. Okay, whatever, buddy. Thank God we got really good weather up on this flight. If we were to fly in something like thunderstorm or like a heavy rainstorm, that would not have been good. I'm glad they chose the flight pattern for like eight in the morning rather than, um, rather than you know, five in the afternoon when rain usually typically starts. I mean, between these islands, they get bad weather, you know, bad hurricanes and uh, all that type of stuff. So, I mean, I mean, I'm glad we. You know, got the good flight path. We got our fighter jet over there in case, you know, anything happens um, with, obviously, like, our fuel or just pretty much anything. Because, uh, you know, we always got fighter jets behind military planes, especially something as big as this. We only got one for today. I think the, I think we should have two. I think we only got one for today. And, yeah. All right, so we're about to hit the runway, and we're about to take off. Um just finished taxiing right now all right prepare for takeoff everybody all right we are officially airborne up oh, dude you're not yeah i was gonna say rookie mistake you're not supposed to remove those landing gears all right our path to greater rockford begins um yeah i think we got to aim more for the right so pretty much a right tilt uh hey what's the what's like the maximum altitude that we're supposed to be heading right now um, 24,000. 24,000, alright, yeah. Seems about right, especially for, like, military planes. Especially for, like, a two and a half hour flight, we're gonna hit it, cruise for, like, 20, no, like, maybe, like, 45 minutes, and then, then we're gonna hit, we're gonna have to, like, descend again, so, it's not gonna be very good. I also don't see the fighter jet, but, it makes sense, we're, like, kinda, like, gonna pass the clouds here soon. All right, we've officially passed the clouds now, so I guess we can go up. What's the current altitude? We have a, we're at about 6,000, so we have a long way to go before we hit that 24,000 mark. Yeah, and I think yeah, it's definitely going to take us a long time to get there. All right, we've passed, I guess, like the second layer of clouds. I think there's about one more layer of clouds to go, so. This is uh, Iceberg 1119 clearing for takeoff. Over. Planning for takeoff. Oh, that's the fighter jet guy. Okay. All right. Looks like we're almost there. Uh, we have our uh, fighter jet. Uh, hold iceberg on. Iceberg 1119 just arrived to the plane. Over. All right. Um, Ryan. Copy that, Iceberg. All right. I guess Iceberg here is going to start, like, filling us here in a second because we need some immediate fuel. So, yeah. Oh, God. He's, like, making a direct 360 around our plane. That is kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Iceberg, All right. iceberg coming is in coming for in. A refuel. Iceberg is coming in for a refuel. All right. Oh, yeah, iceberg. I just deployed the uh, little things down there, and um, looks like it's as coming it in very, very fast. Arrive. All right. Yeah, you know, it's coming up. You see it? Yeah, I see it. All right, it's coming up, coming up. Alright, it's coming in, it's coming in, it's coming in. What is he doing? He just hit the plane! He just hit the dang plane! Hey, 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 turn it around, turn it around, turn it around, turn it around. Dude, what the hell up. did he just- Why- What did he just do? This call sign for- Bro, uh, uplift. freaking thing is just heading. literally smoking. This uplift, uh, for- Uh, this uplift- four, four, zero, four, zero. We are- We're- We're making the scent down all the way to Greater Rockford. We can't make it to the runway. Come over. My god, we're making like a 180 descend into Greater Rockford right now. That is actually crazy. Dude, can you not control this dang speed? We're losing a thousand feet per 10 seconds. 
I can't control it. It's just on its own. I need I need to tell the passengers to brace. All right. Uh, attention all passengers, this is your co-pilot. I need you to brace for landing. We are currently making an emergency landing at Greater Rockford. We will not hit the runway. I repeat, we will Can't not the hit runway. the runway. All right, all right. Uh, control, 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 control. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. All right, all right. We should be good. Try to get in that open field right there. 500, 400. No, try to get in that open field. Build the plane. Speed is, speed is increasing. Speed is increasing. All right, we're at 160 knots. All right, prepare for landing. Oh my God. It's stalling, it's stalling. All right. Stalling. Oh my God. All right, all right, all right. Try to get it slowed down. That was actually softer than I expected. But man, my my head is gonna be starting to hurt. All right, all passengers, stay where you are. I repeat, stay where you are. John, you might want to go check on them. All right, hey, you good? All right, all passengers, you can stand up, head out the plane. Go about 50 meters away in case for any smoke or fires. I do smoke. I, I do see some smoke here. All right. All right. Let, let's go. Every, everyone out of the plane. Everyone out of the plane. All right. Uh, Ryan, go ahead and take them where they need to go. I'll go ahead and call the fire department. Hopefully, Greater Rockford has some fire departments out here. Yo, everyone over here. Everyone that is actually here. crazy. All right. I need to double check. Make sure everybody's off the plane. Make sure everything Repeat, is good this is right iceberg now. going down. I repeat, iceberg is going down. Iceberg is going down. How long has iceberg right, been in the dang here. air? I want to chill here. Just, just chill here until um, the medical service is defined. Copy that. All right, I just did another check of the plane. Everybody is off. Everything is good. It looks like there's a bit of destruction in the front, bit of destruction in the back. Uh, the wing is like completely, like I guess, gone. Hey, what are you doing? Go with the rest of the crew. That thing could blow up any any minute now. That thing could really blow up any minute. All right, we got search and rescue plane here. Hopefully they're gonna land and offer us some assistance. We also have some ground units uh, supporting us as well, like ambulances and stuff as well. All right, yeah, it looks like the PTFS air ambulance is actually landing here. Yeah, I think the plane did catch on fire, so firefighters are gonna have to get to the scene immediately. All right, so we have uh, a little, what is this? Uh, oh, it's a cargo bob. All right, everyone in the cargo, Bob, let's get back to the mainland while the air ambulance take care of anybody. If anybody has signs of injuries, head over to the air ambulance. All right, uh, yeah, Ryan, you should probably co-pilot this thing. Yeah, I was going to say, just get in here. All right, you guys got room for me? Let's just close the door. All right, I guess I'll take care of this little computer thing in here. All right, I guess the other people had some sort of, like, medical injury or whatever they got in like the helicopter me personally i'm fine my head just hurts a little bit we we didn't break like we we didn't go down in the plane as hard as like i thought i would go down to be honest with you it was actually pretty it was it wasn't soft it was like it was like let's say like a plane touching the ground with its wheels but um the wheels broke off as it touched the ground i don't know if i'm describing this as good but it wasn't bad let's just say that all right looks like they're transporting us to greater rockford hospital right now so hopefully hopefully everything's good hopefully we don't have anything seriously wrong with us because that that would be really bad if you guys did enjoy this ptfs roleplay and you want to see more make sure to hit the like button and subscribe and comment down below what kind of ptfs roleplays you want to see it's actually my first real ptfs roleplay and it's actually pretty fun so um, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.